Hi mom, hi Bruce. Uh, I just thought I'd do this really, really quick and put this on my computer and uh, I should look at the lens. Put this on my computer and uh, bump this up to uh, YouTube so you could play this for mom. Um, hi mom, I just wanted to say hi and I love you so much and miss you so much. I wish I had superpowers like Ray Blast so I could just fly down there and see you right now or actually Nova the Human Rocket can fly quicker than Ray Blast so I wish I had those powers but I can't but I wish I could be there but I hope Bruce being there with your mom is is will kinda make up for it cuz we're brothers and we're both your sons so hopefully he can make up for he's being there but make up for me being there too and I just want to tell you mom that I miss you very much and I love you and Bruce, I'm so glad you're there with Mom, and she's getting to watch some of those videos, and I hope they entertain you, Mom. And I so had so much fun, Mom, calling you the other day, and we sang the songs together. That was great. I loved that. And we'll do it again. So, But I want you, I didn't want to call now, but because I wanted you to be able to spend your time with Bruce, but I thought this would be a neat idea. Just put it on video right now, because Bruce said you're right there right now, and I could send this to you. So I just wanted to tell you that I love you, Mom, and miss you very, very much. And um, if Bruce so feels it's okay right now, because I don't want to take time away from him, but um, I want to sing a song for you, Mom. Well, a preacher went out walking, it was on one Sunday morn. It was against his religion, but he took his gun along. He shot himself some mighty fine quail and one little measly hare. And on his way returning home, he made a great big grizzly bear. Now the bear got down in the middle of the road, on all foes a great big toad. He looked the preacher right square in the eye, the preacher looked at him and said bye bye Now the preacher took off and started on the road. The bear went after the preacher to come, they run and they run for about a mile. And they both sat down and rested a while. The preacher got up and he made a bound for a lame He'd be safe and sound. Pull himself up and he turned about. He cast his eyes the skies and he did shout, Oh Lord, you deliver Daniel from the lion's den. Also, deliver Jonah from the belly of the whale. And then the Hebrew children of fire to furnace and a good book to declare, Oh Lord, oh Lord, if you can't help me for goodness sakes, don't help that bear. Da 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 da. Well, just about then, the limb let go and the preacher came tumbling down. He reached his pocket, pulled his razor out just before he hit the ground. He hit the ground with an awful thud. It was a terrible sight. Now the preacher and the bear with the razors and the hair were cutting left and right. They rolled around on the ground. The preacher was up and then he was down. The bear let out an awful moan. It looked like the preacher was on his own. To the heavens, he did glance and said, Lord, just give me one more chance. And his suspenders gave away and he knocked that bear ten foot away. The preacher got up and he made a bound. Forward limber, he'd be safe and Sound, pull himself up and he turned about, he cast his eyes to the skies and he did shout, Oh Lord, you deliver Daniel from the lion's den, also deliver Jonah from the belly of the whale, and then the Hebrew children divided a furnace and a good book do declare, Oh Lord, oh Lord, if you can't help me for goodness sakes, don't help that bear, yeah. That's it, Mom. I could put a ton of stuff on here, but I don't want to. I don't want to put too much on here and and bore you and and Bruce there. But I just want to tell you, Mom, I love you very, very much, and I miss you so much. And I'm glad Bruce is there with you. And Bruce, I'm glad you're there with Mom too. So you you two have a great day today and uh, spending some time together. And I love you very much, both. Love you so much, Mom. Miss you a lot. And Bruce, you know, I love you too, man. <laughs> but I love you, Mom, very, very much. Uh, and uh, we'll talk again soon, Mom. I love you. Bye, bye.